Now back to New Mexico State. Being an FBS independent has its disadvantages, even more so during a pandemic. The university making the decision to postpone football to the spring, followed by the WAC suspending the rest of Aggie fall sports. Doomsday 2.0, the second time in five months Aggie athletics goes dark. We wanted them to have an opportunity to compete. And while, yeah, money is a factor, we were like, hey, we know we're going to take a hit this year, but we want to do everything we can to play. They all wanted to play, and they worked really hard to get to this point. Um, I think just the unknowns and the things that are going on is really difficult for all these kids to handle mentally. New Mexico State had already lost out on $2.75 million when UCLA and Florida canceled on them. The Aggies' schedule quickly went from 12 games down to just four. But perhaps the biggest deciding factor in all of this was the pressure applied by the governor's office. Currently, the state of New Mexico has a 14-day quarantine. Um, it would be impossible to have a football season uh, and adhere to that existing uh, guideline from the state of New Mexico. We thoroughly understand the, the governor's concerns and we're very attentive to those. What we didn't want to do was get in front of our respective conferences. NMSU, of course, is a football independent, so the decision to postpone football was made by the university. However, just minutes later, the WAC came out and suspended the rest of fall sports competition. It is crazy in a lot of ways. Um, the hardest part is the inability to give any real solid answers. The hope now is to be able to play in the spring, but nobody's really sure how that's even going to work. I would love to just cut and paste our fall schedule into the spring, but we don't know what's going to happen. If you're going to play in the next fall, then I think it's really hard to play, obviously, a full schedule in the spring also. With the NCAA canceling fall sports championships, momentum is growing to play those seasons in the spring. Football, completely different story, and the focus is going to turn to eligibility relief for those who do not play or play a significantly shortened season.